Hey guys in this video we are going to be checking out the best pack and play. Through extensive research and testing we've put together a list of options that'll meet the needs of different types of buyers we have included options for every type of user so whether you are looking for a best budget. If you want more information and updated pricing on the product mentioned be sure to check the links in the description below. So let's get started with the video. Number 1. Graco Pack and Play Portable Ployard. The Graco Pack and Play is a no frills option that will serve as a safe place to let your child sleep or play. In fact, our testers found that the basic construction is what made it so easy to assemble, even without instructions. While most of the pack and plays that we tested featured two wheels, our testers noted that the wheels on the Graco seemed the most functional. Pushing it across hardwood, cement floors, and even a shag rug was a breeze. It's also lightweight enough that our tester was able to pick it up and move it from room to room with ease. It has an overall compact design, but it still doesn't feel small compared to other standard-sized packs and plays. Although we were able to set this ployard up in under a minute and a half, the breakdown wasn't quite as intuitive. Tucked away underneath the fabric is a hard-to-grasp button you have to push in order for the sides to properly collapse. Also, this basic model does not come with a fitted sheet, but since it's a standard size ployard, sheets are easy to find in most stores that sell baby gear. If you're in the market for a basic, portable, easy-to-use pack and play, this is a great option. Pros budget-friendly, very easy to move from room to room, decked out with extras, longevity, cons, no extra features, pro for some, number 2. Lotus Travel Crib Backpack Portable Pack and Play The Guava Lotus Travel Crib was easily the most compact of all the pack and plays we tested. When set up, it measures 45.5 by 31.5 by 25.5 inches, and since it only weighs 11 pounds, our tester found it very easy to transport and move from room to room. On the downside, however, this model doesn't have wheels, which would make moving it even easier. We really like the carrying bag that comes with this ployard, too. It's the only one we tested that had a dual design that can be worn as a backpack and on the shoulder, which we found makes it so much easier to carry around, you'll need all of the free hands you can get when traveling with kids. It took our tester a little over two minutes to set up this pack and play, and she didn't need to consult the manual because the process was so intuitive. However, we deducted points from the assembly attribute because the legs of the guava were difficult to collapse, making it challenging to close completely. While our testers liked the carrying tote, the pack and play required a substantial amount of effort to force back in the bag. While we liked the material of the guava, it wasn't nearly as stain-resistant as the other pack and plays that we tested, so we rated it a 3 for the care attribute. Pros Compact design folds into backpack, mattress buckles in for extra safety, travel bag can be worn as a backpack, cons hard to collapse, number 3. Graco Pack and Play Ployard Snuggle Suite This Graco Pack and Play Snuggle Suite has it all and then some. It comes with a removable infant bouncer, an optional bassinet, a diaper changing table, storage pockets, and a sound machine. Seriously, if you're looking for all of the features possible at an affordable price point, this is your best option. All of these features give this model longevity, which is why we think it's the best convertible one on the market. While this isn't the smallest plier that we tested, it's still fairly compact, given all of the different ways it can be used. It features two back wheels, which makes moving it from room to room easy, especially given it's one of the heavier pack and plays available. The Snuggle Suite lost points for assembly because it took the longest to set up and we rated it the lowest with a 2 for the assembly attribute. Thanks to the robust features, the unclear directions, and more than 15 parts, it took our tester nearly 40 minutes to set this one up, with the bassinet being the most time-consuming part. The pliard can be tucked away into its sturdy carrying case, however, it's not large enough to hold all of the attachments, which can make traveling with it difficult. If you're looking for something that will serve as a crib alternative, though, we think this is the best pick. Pros Decked out with extras, longevity, sturdy enough to use as a crib, high-quality storage bag, cons, 
Confusing Assembly, Number 4. Juvie Room Superscript 2 Ployard, Portable Pliard. If you're looking for a pack and play with a bit of extra space, you can't go wrong with the Juvie Room 2. Measuring 39.75 by 39.75 by 31 inches, this ployard is roomier than most others, giving babies and toddlers plenty of space to play, rest, and hang out. While we didn't need to know much to set it up, it was convenient that the juvie ployard had the directions printed on the bottom of the mattress. This means you'll never have to rummage through your junk drawer to find the paper manual. That same mattress doubles as a high-quality travel bag. Although we thought the mattress quality and the roomy size were standout features, our tester noted that its perfectly square shape would make finding extra fitted sheets tricky at best, since the standard size won't work. We weren't surprised to find this ployard on the heavier side, but we were pleased to discover that it's quite easy to move around when it's set up, thanks to the two back wheels. We also really liked that this ployard has mesh sides all the way around, so your baby will be visible no matter where you're standing. Number 5. Dream On Me Nest Portable Play Yard. This National Parenting Product Awards winner is simple and stylish and won't break the bank. If you want a quality product at one of the lowest prices, this pack and play really delivers. It's lightweight, easy to fold and compact when folded, making it easy for busy parents to transport. This one also gives your baby a 360 view so they know you are nearby and you can keep an eye on them from anywhere without anything blocking your view. The Dream On Me Nest is a no-frills pack and play, it doesn't come with a bassinet, changing pad or storage. It doesn't have wheels either, which might be a deal breaker for someone who plans to move it around the house frequently. But if you are on a budget and need a basic place for your little one to sleep and nap on the go, this award-winning product is a really nice, easy-to-use and simply designed option. Alright guys that's all for now, if you enjoyed this video please go ahead and leave a like, comment and make sure to hit that subscribe button and enable your notification bell icon to get the latest videos of our channel be sure to check out the description for links to find the most updated pricing on all the products mentioned in this video.